Hi Taurus, welcome to your weekly channeled message. Let's find out what the message is for you in the current moment. My readings aren't date specific or time specific. They're you versus them scenarios. They can apply at any given moment in space time that you felt guided to the channel by spirit. Please note that this is not tarot. These are intuitive channeled messages. So not every message is going to resonate every single week with you unless you're incredibly lucky. So take on board the messages that resonate and leave the others behind if they're not for you. It's not your week. So there's a lot of messages that need to go out to people from the higher realm. So you get a message one week consider yourself very lucky okay so i'm just the messenger if there's no messages from me for you i'm sure there'll be another channel that you can tune into that has a message for you all right so let's get started here taurus what's the energy that wants to come through for your message this week what is the message for taurus please spirit Okay, so we have the spirit animal of the octopus. So I feel like you are either the octopus or you're dealing with someone who's in the energy of the octopus. It can be reversed however it resonates to you. But basically, um, you're either dealing with or you are in your intuition. So the octopus is an energy of clairvoyance. It's a very gifted, intuitive energy. So we've got the alchemical symbol for water here. So someone is using their feelings and their senses and they've got their tentacles out and they're, they're really listening to their intuition about your connection or situation. So I feel like, you know, someone's really like tapped in, connected and listening to their intuitive abilities um, about whatever's going on between you and them and it's someone quite clairvoyantly gifted so it could be you know someone very intuitive or psychic that you know is um yeah is connected to you okay <laughs> um and one more message <laughs> okay so i feel like what's happening here is um okay now that this has come through i feel like this is your energy taurus but it really doesn't apply it doesn't really matter who is the taurus the message for taurus is that um you're dealing with somebody or you are somebody who's very intuitively gifted and you have the ability of um, clairvoyance and I feel like you are sensing and putting your feelers out and I feel like you're going into this situation really blind with not much information because there's a lot of darkness around you and you're quite intuitive and I feel like your intuitive abilities are <laughs> shocking people and you're all, almost teasing them from afar so I feel like you're very gifted and you know this, right? And you're like, I'm going to like, I think it's something that you might hide, Taurus. Like you kind of hide how gifted you are. You kind of hide how intuitive you are. You kind of hide how psychic you are. I feel like your psychic abilities are shocking the pants off people. We've got the gotcha energy. It's very accurate, whatever it is you're doing. And I feel like you're channeling messages and people are like, holy shit, like, you're teasing them with your psychic abilities almost. It's like teasing from afar. So I feel like this is people that are watching 
you and your psychic abilities and they're like oh my god they're shocked it's so accurate it's scarily accurate and i feel like you're just you know intuitively um feeling and sensing your way through these energies and you're teasing people with your psychic abilities you're like oh yeah you want to do wrong by me you want to be um disrespectful to me that's fine i'll just expose your dirty laundry i will just use my psychic abilities to see what i can you know intuitively figure out about you so <laughs> whatever you figured out about people it's got them this is the energy of gotcha it's got them stunned it's got them shocked they're like oh my god how does she know that that's crazy and it's almost freaking them out like you're so gifted psychically and intuitively that you're freaking people out and i feel like you know you're lifting the lid the green woman is all about lifting the lid on this you're expanding people's consciousness consciousness with your psychic abilities as well because you're lifting the lid on on you know their innermost thoughts like i feel like i'm seeing that this is someone's like consciousness here their brain and you're just placing your hands over their brain and like almost like tapping into the energy it's like reading people it's a mind reading energy you're like so gifted and intuitive you're like channeling messages or whatever it is you're doing and you're reading people's minds and they're kind of mind blown i'm hearing mind blown so that's the first message and i always at the start just get stumped of how the message is going to come through because like i just it just hits me like i get a message and then it goes boom the channeling so sometimes i always like get to a bit of a false start in a reading but anyway let's find out the other energy that wants to come through but basically that's the first message you are very gifted and clairvoyant and you are mind-blowing people with your intuition your psychic abilities are super accurate and it's freaking people out <laughs> it's like gotcha like oh my god how does she know this how is she doing this oh my god she must be the le legit so whatever you're doing people are, are really like thinking it's scary it's very accurate so if you are a real psychic or clairvoyant you're channeling um from spirit which is a higher power the divine so it's always going to be more accurate than tarot readings like that's why i always say at the start of my messages you know this is not tarot a tarot card is not a channeled message from the higher dimensions that are constantly watching us and looking over us a tarot reading is you know, um, somebody interpreting whatever a card means and not using their clair clairvoyant abilities. It's just, you know, some people don't have these gifts that you have. And I think people might be used to watching tarot readers, you know, and people who are just trying to interpret messages through cards that they're not really understanding. And you're just getting the messages like really accurately and it's freaking people out because it's, super accurate and you're very gifted and talented and you're kind of just doing it really playfully and you kind of just like okay you want to mess with me i'm gonna read your mind <laughs> that's the vibe i'm getting so it's very cheeky all right so let's find out what else is coming through the reading i feel like it's this one I love these cards, like they feel so nice because <laughs> they're new. It's like beautiful energy to work with when I um, channel messages here. <laughs> I got the spirit animal of the cobra. So some people are a little bit angry. They're a little bit jealous. They are a bit tricky, triggered and defensive about whatever it is you're doing. So I feel like Taurus, you could be a reader on YouTube. Like you could be um, a psychic medium and I feel like you might be channeling messages from spirit and it might have people quite triggered and defensive and pissed off like that you know things about them. They're a little bit angry. They're a little bit um, defensive because they can't do anything about it you know this this is like a gift from god that you've got and god is sending the messages it's a, it's a strong message right um when you get a 
get a channeled message that's from a psychic god is you know trying to communicate with you don't shoot the messenger is the vibe i'm getting right now so you're this messenger over here and you're sending messages from the higher realms from spirit from god whatever you want to label the divine um you know, a lot of people associate the word God with religion. So I, I don't always use the word God, but I do believe there is, is a God. So, um, yeah, when you channel messages, it's coming from God and he is, he is using you as a channel, as a, a messenger for people. <laughs> and they're quite defensive and pissed off and triggered because, what you're saying is so accurate and spot on. You know, you're the mirror that some people don't want to face and they're getting pissed off and they're getting jealous that, you know, you have these abilities and like, why does she have these abilities? So it's quite triggering and confronting for some people. <laughs> okay so i feel like you've got people from your your past watching you and they're missing you like it's making people quite angry because i feel like you know we have tart on the poet i feel like there's an audience of people possibly watching you and they're getting quite triggered and then the people that are familiar to you a longing for you from afar and I feel like you know they're missing you they're missing your energy and they're people that you know didn't actually appreciate you when you're in their lives so I feel like these people are quite mentally disturbed with the Pona's wild daughter's energy over you know the fact that you're very gifted clairvoyant and you're very accurate with whatever you're doing and it's making them quite defensive and angry that you're hitting the nail on the head and they're realizing, you know, they miss you and they want you in your life, but it's mentally disturbing them that they can't access you. They can't um, right their wrongs with you. And you're just, you know, using these, these octopus tentacles to intuitively feel this energy, teasing them from afar and showing them your worth. And I think you've got past people that are quite angry that they didn't respect you. They didn't see your value almost to the point where they're up at night thinking about you, they can't sleep and they're, they're feeling like a sense of karma because they miss you. They want you in their life and they feel like they screwed things up with you and God is kind of teaching them a lesson, if that makes sense. There's karma here and karma involved. So I'm going to leave that there and take this over to the extended reading, Taurus. If you're resonating with the message, the link is below in the description box to the extended reading. You can follow me over to Vimeo where you can access the reading individually or you can join my Patreon page for an entire month at a discounted rate. I really appreciate your energy exchange. Keeps me on YouTube full time. All that information is in the description box below. Check it out by clicking the link in the description box and heading over there. Otherwise, I'll see you next week. Take care. Bye, Taurus.